but I haven't seen Caillou and Javil around here in a while. Do you know why they've been absent? By gossip groups, I heard that they were competing in a Chicago street fight. It was a massacre. Caillou suffered head trauma, and Javel only has one eye. One eye? Damn. That's tough. But at the same time, that's literal karma for all the shit Javil has put everyone through. I must concur on that statement. Javil has been a major threat to nearly 75% of the people in this school, and that even includes the teachers and staff as well. Thankfully, we both got to admit, it's been quiet and very serene around this district, which is a good thing, since chaos has been striking at everyone constantly. Once again, I must concur. And we can concur on the fact that you both are pants in the asses. Well well well, if it isn't Mr. Bloody Noodles. And as well as Mr. Slime Gang Goblin. What the fuck do you random ass kids want this time? Word. This is a conversation between me and Damien, so get lost you chumps. We overheard what you both said about Jackville, about how he deserved to get his eye cut out. Yeah, it's like you wanted him to suffer, and we find that to be disrespectful in our perspectives. Dude, we never wanted that to happen to him. All we did was point out that he got karma driven to his head for all the shit he's done. As well as implying that, we feel bad for Caillou and Jarville for getting in that predicament, but at the same time, we knew Jarville got the worst of it. See, I know deep down you wanted Jarville that to get scarred. You and your pussy friends always gotta assume the worst and wish bad shit on us. Eris Lim, shut the fuck up. You sound dead as fuck right now, so how about you go to class and get some common sense? We told you, we never wanted Javil's eye to be cut out. And besides, I don't get how it's our fault. Cause it sounds like you're trying to blame us for Javil's fatal event. It is your fault, cause Caillou, you, and the rest of your more friends always ruin the Hawkeyes and its roaster. Just just as it as Aeroslim. Blaming us for shit that we never got involved in. Needless to add, that we don't ruin your roster, because you and your idiotic friends jump us first more than anyone. Kid, what the fuck are you on, huh? You and your stupid friends start shit with the hawk eyes all the fucking time, no matter what. You can't be talking ja, cause you're a dick rider. You literally came up to us, and you and Aeroslim started shit with us, so quit being hypocritical. Another thing. Don't talk at all, because you have a slutty girlfriend that nobody likes. All she wants to do is sex you up and use your money. Hey! Want to repeat that? Go ahead. I'm all ears. Oh great, the green slut is here right next to her scruffy man. What are you finna do, grind on him and spend all his money? Cause that's what I always hear about you Lisa. Don't test me pussy boy. You're about to dig your own grave right now. Oh yeah, sure we are buddy. How about you get a needle, and deflate that fake ass of yours, and deflate your brain as well, cause you sound like Lenny Loud. You both just never want to give it up and accept the fact that you're just a bunch of wusses, duh. That's enough, especially you, Hog Ice Team. Oh no. I'm out. No way. I don't believe it. You never thought you would see Mr. again, Hunter or Slim. Well. You thought wrong, my old friend. Back from the hospital again, duh. I'm surely finna fix that. You're outnumbered, so it's not finna happen. Not so fast, bums. You aren't finna hurt anyone else. You fucking dumbass jits ruined Javil and affected our roster. And for that, we declare a fight against you boys. Better step out of this little boy. Cause we'll smash on you like the magit you are, with your tiny ass puffer coat. Watch, Watch your, your mouth. mouth. Alright, that's it. We've had it with you three. We're finna give you the same process of eradication like in Bradley Animation's 2021's universe. That's not happening, buddy. Not this time. That's right. You're finna have to improvise your plans better than that if you think we came and prepared this time. Bringing lethal weapons in my school? As well as fighting in the hallways? Oh no you jokers don't. I'll be stopping this shit right here right now. But Mr. Kirkin, we didn't start it, they did. We promise. I don't give a fuck about who started it or who even tried to end it. All I know is you all are fighting with lethal weapons in my school, and you know weapons are prohibited here. That's it, all six of you mongrels are suspended for five months. Go home right now while I call your parents about what you all did. 
Oh, come on. Damien, we're fully pissed with you for fighting with three kids and bringing a weapon to school. That's it, you're grounded for five months. Since you can't find a way to behave at all, go to your room and stay up there until further notice. Craycraft, we can't believe you had the crazy mind of five three boys and brought a huge weapon to the school building. That is it kid, you're grounded for five months. March upstairs to your room, right now. Unacceptable behavior he sang. I can't believe you brought a weapon in school and fought three kids as well. You just got out the hospital, and you do something dumb as this? Retarded, that's it, you're grounded for five months. Get to bed, now. Not even surprise era slim. I'm not even shocked you got into a fight with Damien, Craycraft and Isang. You know what, go to your room, cause you're grounded for five months, as well as that, you also lost your electronic privileges for the rest of the month for bringing a weapon to school. Now scram. Why? <laughs> Nice work, Jar. You got suspended for fighting and bringing a weapon to school. Nice going. For that, you will also be grounded for five months. Move to bed, go. Why? Wixen, are you serious? I can't believe you fought in school against three of your foes, as well as bringing a massive weapon to school. That's it, you're grounded for five months. Get your ass up to that room of yours, right now. 